What's up guys? So before I get this video going, I just want to let you guys know that I made a huge mistake. While I was editing the video, I accidentally deleted like 90% of Cleo Max clips. And I was so upset and I was thinking of like just playing more games and getting the, the uh, clips back like that. But that would have just took so much longer and I'm going to be, be very busy over the weekend. So that would have took even longer to get them back. So I figured just show what I got and guys just take my word for it with everything I say about Mac. You guys know I, I would never steer you wrong. So here we go. Who is the better pass rusher, Miller or Mac? Now, Miller has a 93 finesse move and Mac has a 93 power move. So in a sense, they're almost tied right there. Their strength rating, very similar, the 84 to the 82, and speed-wise, 84 to the 85. Now, for me, I was so used to having Ndamukong and Sue be the only one getting consistent pressure on the quarterback, but when I got Mac out there to blitz with him, that changed everything. I mean, him and Sue were getting consistent pressure on the quarterback and making my defense even that much more dangerous. You see him right there with a the red star under him, just blow by that uh, right tackle and, and just freak that guy out right here. He goes untouched and he's just so fast getting in the backfield and stopping that play. So believe me, take my word for it when I say Khalil Mack is very disruptive. Now when it came to Von Miller, his tackling was just as good as Khalil Mack. You see right there, he gets a nice little block shed, a very, very clutch tackle. Look at this, he runs all the way across the field, chases down AP for a loss in the backfield. So I liked what I saw from there, or I mean from his tackling. Now as you see right here, just like Mac, he may not always get the sack, but they're both so good at getting pressure on the quarterback. Like right here, look at this. Chasing down this quarterback, making him panic, and you know he wanted to uh, run with the quarterback, but uh, Miller was right there with him the whole time. Here's another example, just freaking him out and making him throw the ball way before he wants to. But of course, the real question that you guys uh, want to know is who's the better pass rusher? And as you see right here, Miller is very disruptive, just like Mac. And to answer the question, I would say Miller is better. But the thing is, he's not much better. You know, if I had to give them a grade, I would give Miller a solid A, and I would give Mac an A minus. So you see, Miller does win, but it's not by much. And that's why I'm going to be sticking with Mac because price-wise, it's not even close. Miller goes for like 120, Mac goes for like 40. So Miller may win, but he's not cheap. So that's going to wrap this up guys and once again guys I am so sorry that there was not much of Khalil Mack. I can't believe I deleted that shit. Nobody's more pissed than I was man especially as soon as I saw myself do it I was like oh my god I did not make that dumbass mistake again. But anyways guys like I said Miller does win but it's not by, uh, not by much so whoever you decide to go with it's up to you. Of course if you got crazy coins go with Miller but if you're on a budget like I am right now go with Mac. He'll do just or should I say almost as good as Miller does but anyways guys that's going to wrap this up. Don't forget to like to spread awareness, comment so you can voice your opinion, and subscribe so you'll be up to date with this content when it drops. And I'll see you boys later. Peace.